Hi, welcome to Daily Net. The first news today about the continuation of the drama Fox Spirit Matchmaker. Fox Spirit Matchmaker is a Chinese romance manhwa by Tuo Shao Xin that has been converted into a successful animation and video game. Drama adaptations of these three manhwas will be developed this year. Because the plot involves multiple arcs, such as the Yue Hong chapter, which will be starred by several well-known actors such as Yang Mi, Simon Gong, Christy Guo, Miles Wei, Julian Xin, and Wen Zheng Rong, who are presently awaiting the broadcast schedule. Then, with a similarly big cast list, two additional chapters are ready for production. The Zhu Ye chapter, which is now in production and is said to star Cecilia Liu as the female lead. Several names have been floated for the male cast in Chapter Zhu Ye, including Li Xian, JCT, Yang Yang, Chen Shao, and Kenny Lin. Many expected Kenny Lin to assume the part, however there are new whispers that newbie Zhang Yunlong has been picked to join the project. Meanwhile, the Wang Chuan chapter of the Fox Spirit Matchmaker series, which tells the painful love story of a powerful warrior named Wang Chuan Fu Gui, who is nicknamed the ultimate military weapon, and an unknown little spirit named Xing Tong. They go through a painful love that's akin to, to having one's heart pierced by thousands of arrows. The male lead was formerly rumored to be Leo Wu, but will now most likely be filled by Dylan Wong, who is currently the hottest actor in his mid-twenties. With the name Yang Chao Yue tied to the project, some netizens complained due to her unsteady acting in The Journey of Changza. Many netizens were concerned that her performance might have an impact on Dylan Wong and offered critical comments such as, how many dramas does she have to ruin? And if she's in it, then I won't watch. On the other hand, there are others who are prepared to give her a chance because her new drama Love You Seven Times has the potential to become a hit. Further news came from Andy Yong and Shu Kai, who are currently in talks to star in the upcoming family drama. Recently, it was rumored that the next family drama story of Joy will begin production soon, with Andy Yang and Shu Kai being offered the lead roles. The drama is based on Yishu's novel stories of Mai Chung Huan and will be produced by Watchy Media and Tencent Video. The filming process is tentatively expected to commence in June 2023. The novel, Stories of Mai Chung Huan, chronicles the narrative of a post-95 girl named Mai Chung Huan, who was born in a low-income family in Shanghai and was always pressured by her mother to marry her boyfriend. However, her boyfriend's family's economic situation, which is significantly better, causes the emotionally equal relationship to become unbalanced. At the same time, her mother's overbearing meddling in her daughter's lifelong events hastens the split between Mai Chung Huan and her lover. Between being loyal to her parents and loyal to herself, Mai Chung Huan gradually liberated herself from her mother's intense attention and became more focused on her career. Her commitment to her profession has also been acknowledged by the leadership at her workplace, who has entrusted her with more critical assignments. Yao Jiming, the grandson of the company's CEO and a manager where her works, is also interested in Mai Chung Huan. And as time passed, they became more open about their emotions for one another. Andy Yang was approached about playing Mai Chung Huan, while Xu Kai was expected to portray the male protagonist, Yao Jiming. Although the collaboration between the two is eagerly anticipated, neither party's agency have revealed any additional information. Next, Yang Mi is said to be planning a surprise in her forthcoming drama. Recently, Chin Hao introduced a new drama called Harbin 1944 on which Yang Mi will collaborate, and added that Yang Mi will surprise the audience in an unusual way. This fascinating espionage war drama was co-created by Zhang Li and Wang Xiaoqiang, and Yang Mi plays Guan Shui, the chief of the Secret Service section, a job that is both dangerous and endearing. This announcement has people excited about the upcoming new drama. According to reports, Harbin 1944 concentrates on destroying Japanese Secret Service operatives and chronicles the narrative of a Chinese Communist Party-led anti-Japanese team in Harbin during the anti-Japanese war. Guan Shui is a brilliant female agent who appears frigid on the outside but is warm on the inside. Meanwhile, Yangmi has ruled as traffic queen for over 10 years. Her appearance in this drama will undoubtedly add to the overall mystery and excitement. Simultaneously, Chin Hao applauded Yang Mi's performance, stating that Yang Mi has demonstrated exceptional acting talent in this collaboration and is a very good actress. Many fans agree with this assessment, and everyone is hoping that Yang Mi will provide even stronger performances in this upcoming drama. Furthermore, Chin Hao's acting skills in the recently famous The Long Season were excellent, giving the impression that he was acting in his genuine colors. Furthermore, there have been previous good works like As the Hidden Corner, 
so fans should revisit it and look forward to Chin Hao's new performance with Yang Mi. Chin Hao, on the other hand, was said to have shed 10 kilograms for the part. This was revealed in a post by his wife, Annie Shizuka Ino, who divulged her husband's weight loss recipe. In short, the collaboration of Yang Mi and Chin Hao will demonstrate to the audience the strength of two great actors while also providing optimism for this new drama. Let us all look forward to it. The following shocking news came from Chin Lan, who was widely rumored to have refused Wei Da Shun's marriage proposal. Wei Da Shun has showed a propensity towards dating older ladies. He was formerly linked to Yang Mi and is currently spotted vacationing in Hainan with actress Chin Lan, who is 10 years his senior. They allegedly began dating after filming the drama Dr. Tong in 2022. Despite being seen repeatedly by paparazzi, the pair has never acknowledged or rejected the allegations. On May 5th, Hong Kong media reported that Wei Da Shun had proposed to his girlfriend, the lovely actress Chin Lan. His efforts, however, were met with rejection. As a result, the two went into a cold war, and their relationship was said to be strained. According to rumors, the handsome actor genuinely wanted to marry, so he mustered up the nerve to propose to Chin Lan. But he didn't expect to be rejected outright by Chin Lan. This was due to the fact that the two parties had yet to reach an agreement on marriage. Chin Lan was known to have high ambitions for her profession and was not pleased with becoming someone's wife. Wei Da Shun was not Chin Lan's first rejection. She had previously turned down director Lu Chuan's proposition four times. Chin Lan previously reacted sheepishly in a Yes I Do season four reality show, said, my current status is what everyone can see. Let's take it slow. This rumors went viral and sparked debate among netizens until they received a reaction from management and the performer. On May 5th, Wei Da Shun responded on his Weibo account, saying that his parents had been repeatedly insulted as a result of the rumors. Although the allegations were unverified, it was understandable that Wei Da Shun was eager to establish a family. He is the sole son of a wealthy family with nine Chinese enterprises worth more than 10 billion yen. His parents said on a reality show last year that they wanted as many grandchildren as possible. They also stated that having a daughter-in-law from the entertainment industry would be preferable so that she could get along better with Wei Da Shun. Thank you for watching. Please leave your thoughts in the comments section and see you in the next video.